stomach. <sighs> Parishioners and uh, friends. In a world replete with vicissitudes. No, too many S's. Vicissitudes, far too tongue twisting. In a world brimful of fluctuations. No, replete with flux. No, replete with changes, with change. Possibly. In a world of change. In times of change. Well, at least I understand that. Your, um, my dear parishioners, gathered here today, all 23 of you, one thing is certain that everything changes. Theoretically. Alistair, Alistair, why not simply tell them? Yes, all miserable 23 of them. Their 46 miserable buttocks squirming on the pews. Why not simply tell them the brutal truth that times are changing, yet again? But only for you. They probably know already. The hanging baskets in the high street are planted with secret microphones dangling from the begonias. Rumours will be scuttling through the village like rats with loudspeakers. <laughs> My dear parishioners, I am being moved on again. Come Monday, I will have departed from your midst, and I see how heartbroken you are. Or are not. Not, then. <laughs> the good Reverend Morpeth is being moved on for no longer being good at what he does. What is that? I'm no longer sure. I preside at funerals. At funerals I excel, but weddings? No, I have the wrong face for weddings. Too serious, they tell me. Glum is what they mean. To the children of the school I'm Rev Morbid. The teachers insert an expletive between morbid and rev. So, dearly beloved, sad to depart, to forsake you, my congregation, my... Host beyond number? No. I've forgotten your names. I shall rapidly forget your faces. Will I carry close to my heart enraptured memories of the sparkling conversations we have shared? No. Will I miss these scintillating surroundings? Will I holstered prisoner I count the grains of dust squatting in my lump and chair contemplating nothing? No. To all these questions, no. On Monday, when I'm gone, please pour petrol over these threadbare sofa, set it ablaze and fan the flames. With the hymn books, if you choose. The room is ash already. Ash and dust. Burning it down will be a blessing. <laughs> to refresh it any other way requires a miracle.